Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Taurus. So this is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energies, Taurus. Let's see what's coming up for your general energies, guys, before moving on to your love energies, Taurus. Let's see what's coming up for your general energies, Taurus, first, okay? And then we will be moving on for your love energies, for your general energies. Okay, so Doris, all I see here is that you want to manifest some things in life. You just want, you just have a lot of dreams that you want to accomplish, I see here. And you kind of will be working to accomplish your dreams, okay? You will be doing whatever it takes to accomplish whatever you want in life. You will be this person who's continuously doing something or the other to kind of impress people around you or you will be doing whatever it is to really what to say to manifest certain things okay that's the energy that i get for you here you'll be doing whatever it takes to manifest whatever you're doing and you'll be really happy to actually do whatever you feel like doing okay so that's what i see for you here guys You're also going to be this person who everybody likes. You're just going to be loved by everyone around you. Or everyone is going to just love you no matter what. Okay, whatever you do, no matter what situation that you're in, people are going to love you. Okay, you might be wondering why this is even happening. Why do people love me? But yes, people are going to love you. Okay. Also, what I'm getting for you is that with a five of swords, you guys, maybe someone cheated you, maybe like you were defeated by some people, you feel like you kind of accepted a challenge and you were defeated, you feel like so sad being in that energy, but right now you just want to prove people that you are worth it, okay, that you are that you can accomplish, that you can have a new beginning, and so you will work on your on yourself or you work on something to accomplish and to achieve and to prove people whoever kind of like brought you down or something like that you're just in this accomplishment stage okay so that's what i see for you here Again, you want to be this person who's really brave, who's really honest with everyone and that's how you're going to be. Even though if, the, if you're going to hurt someone by saying the truth, you're just going to be truthful, okay? Let's see what's coming up for your love energies, your person's feelings towards you, okay? Your person's energies, person's feelings for you. What are your person's feelings for you, Doris? So what I see here is this person actually guys, the actual energy goes like this. They just know that the separation happened. They just feel really sad that it actually happened and they really regret the separation. But all they want to tell you is that they, they're just going to be like, I know this happened. I know I treat, didn't treat you well. I know I had to accomplish a lot of my dreams and that's why I left you. But they just want to forget the past and they want to start fresh. So when this person comes towards you, they don't want you to talk about all those sick energy that you were in before. They will prefer talking about 
like how they want to stay with you okay they just will prefer talking about what how they want to stay with you right now and they won't like talking about the past energy so that's what i feel from this person so they will come towards you but they just want to forget the past they just want you to forget the past now they're done with the past and they just want you to start fresh with the new energy okay so this is all i feel for you here guys my lovely taurus i hope you got the entire reading i hope you understand so this is all i feel for you all thank you all so much for watching your lucky color for today is blue and your lucky crystal for today is amethyst bye guys see you all tomorrow hi guys how are you all doing my lovelies this is going to be another very general message from your person reading so it's like a pick a card reading i will be laying out three cards and you get to choose uh, one from these three piles okay let me just lay out these piles guys if you have any questions to ask me you can ask me in the comments or maybe i will come live maybe day after or day after tomorrow or maybe on this sunday so you can like ask me any questions that time when i come live okay okay guys so these are the piles that i have laid out you can choose any pile that you want to and I will give you a message the message from your person how are they thinking about you how are they feeling about you do they love you do they still care about you and everything about this person and about your connection with this person okay so make sure to close your eyes and meditate for about five to ten minutes okay just pause the video and start meditating and you can choose a pile and you can start the reading okay open your eyes and see which pile attracts you the most and choose that pile okay i will start this is the pile number one two and three so i'll start with the pile number one now pile number two and three please wait uh please someone put the timestamps in the what they say comments so that it'll be easy for the others to kind of like get with the reading okay guys i'm really sorry fine so for the pile number one for those who chose the pile number one let us see what is actually came up for you guys how does this person think about you feel about you okay so you need to release this person out for those of you who chose this pile i think like you're really like clingy to this relationship you're clingy on this person so you need to try to release this person out of your life to kind of have this person forever in your life so try to release this person out i know it might sound crazy it might sound a little weird but please start, try at least to kind of like release this person out of your life otherwise it is going to be really hard for you to make this relationship possible okay because you need to release this person out otherwise they're not going to come otherwise they're not going to crave for your love they're not going to crave for your attention so please make sure to release this person out and yes they are going to crave for your attention after that okay you always take the pain away we are independent individuals yet when we are together we are inseparable so all i can see here with this person is that guys they really do care too much for you they do love you too much they care too much for you and they're even willing to do whatever they have to to kind of have this relationship with you guys because they're very concerned about you they're very concerned about your life they're very concerned about having this relationship with you and yes guys that is again what i can see here my lovely who chose the pile number one so this person does care too much for you and caring too much can be a problem too in some cases so 
if you don't feel comfortable with this person if you feel like they they're not the one for you if you feel like they're not caring for you you just don't feel like this is the relationship for a lifetime or if you're having a lot of negative feelings negative uh, energy towards this connection it's okay guys don't think too much everything is going to go according to your expectations but please don't think too much don't hurt yourselves thinking a lot because it is again going to get you into a bad energy it is again going to get you into a bad feeling okay so that is again what i can see here my lovelies i hope you got the overall energies guys my lovely who chose the pile number one and yes i hope this reading really resonated with you guys if it did make sure to watch my weekly monthly and pick card readings my lovely who chose the pile number one this person definitely loves you but you need to let go of them if you're going to stay clingy it is not going to work out okay so let us move on to the pile number two okay so for those of you who chose the pile number two guys this is the reading for you guys your dreams need a practical plan you would do anything i say you turn me on so what i can see here is that this person definitely loves you but they feel like this relationship is not possible i don't know why they're getting a very negative feeling with them i don't know why they're being very negative but they definitely love you i would never say that they don't love you they don't care for you they're definitely very very concerned about you they do love you a lot they very um they would do anything to kind of manifest a relationship with you all that is definitely that but also i can see here that this person guys has a lot of other things that they need to manifest it is not just you that they're thinking about they have a lot of other things that they need to care for that they need to manifest and that can also be the reason why they're not coming towards you because there are a lot of other things that they're manifesting a lot of other things that they're caring for and yes uh, this is also what i can see for you here guys my lovelies and i hope you got the overall energies my lovely who chose the pile number two and i can also see here that this person feels very physically attracted to you they feel emotionally drawn to you and they also feel like you would obey them you would do whatever the you have to, to make them happy so this person loves you because they feel like you would uh definitely like understand them and obey them so this is all i can see here guys for you for those who chose the pile number two now i'll be moving on to the pile number three okay so we have work through your fears this person is scared to come towards you that is a ma uh, that is a major energy for those who chose the pile number three this person has some fears that is not allowing them to come towards you they're scared of how intense this relationship is they're scared of how comfortable they feel with you they have a lot of fears that is stopping them from coming towards you and this person feels like you can read that in the most thoughts you can understand them completely you do whatever they you have to with them like this person generally is very very concerned about you they're very drawn to your energies they do understand you completely and that is again the major energy that the feeling is to come towards you guys okay so this is all i can see here and this person also w is very very concerned about you and they will come towards you soon but it might take a while for a few of you if you're especially a cancer pisces scorpio this person will come towards you soon if you are a taurus Virgo, capricorn aquarius libra gemini it can take time for this person to come okay so bye guys see you all tomorrow don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel bye